what's going on? It's Alexander here, back with some more Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Uh, actually, since he's just right down the way here. We'll do each and, each and every one of these quests, because why not, you know? You look concerned. I'm worried about Persephone. I haven't been here long, but I've already heard people want her overthrown. You have? What do these humans expect from her? I'd heard some of the more ungrateful delinquents are planning to rise up. Imagine! These uh, ungrateful delinquents... Could they be right? Bah! You give them too much credit. Still, Persephone needs protection. Don't look at me. There's a friend of mine and your father's, Kiros of Zarax. He's a strong and honorable warrior. He's been abducted, but if we could free him... You're suggesting we make... A human? Persephone's bodyguard? With Kiros at the ready, the humans will think twice before attacking one of their own. <laughs> if I didn't know any better, I'd say you were in love with Persephone. No one understands her the way I do. Avenis sees a cruel despot. To her husband, she's a trinket on his arm. And what do you see? Me? Oh, I, I don't know. I've never had anyone ask me before. She's... Uh, everything. How do you know this, Kiros? He was an aide, of sorts, to your father. Every great painter needs a hand to crush their pigment. That was Kiros, a warrior. Say no more. I'll find Kiros for you. Ah, I knew I could trust you. While you're gone, I'll arrange a meeting with Persephone. Bring Kiros to the heart of Elysium. We'll be there. Okay. Well, might as well if we have it. Eh. Don't like going too much weaker. Just set a helmet. Let's see here. There's nobody back here, so... of Zarax. Hermes sent me. That keymaker is predictable. I'll give him that much. So, there we go. How do you get that stuff? Pythagoras was my father. Things happened. Now it's mine. Ah, is that right? 
That makes us family. I knew the man well. I heard. This way. Persephone is waiting. Persephone herself? This is going to be easier than I thought. Wait. What's going to be easier? All right, Kiros. Let's make this quick. You said this is going to be easier than you thought. Since we're basically family, I'm trusting your honor. I work for Adonis. But you were caged by humans. Yes, and Hermes found out about it. Right around the time Persephone was coaxed into deciding she needs a bodyguard. You staged the whole thing and you're using Hermes to infiltrate Persephone's lair? You're no simple warrior. Before I met your father, I had four sons. Each a warrior. When my third boy fell in battle, there was only guilt. I'd cried all my tears for the first two. Go on. And with the fourth, I felt longing. Sadness had become my only friend. And I had no one left to grieve. Warriors don't bring peace. They bring sorrow. So by getting behind Persephone's defenses, you think you can prevent war? You could convince her to surrender or distract her while Adonis escapes. Anything but battle. But before we go to Persephone, I have to send confirmation this plan worked. Will you take me? Fine, but be quick. We need to go to Persephone and Hermes. They're waiting. You really think you can save lives? I'm not sure how death works in Elysium. But suffering is eternal, and that Come is on. something I yeah. can't stop. I like him. I really hope nothing bad happens to him. all of them. Let's keep moving. Once Adonis hears my plan worked, maybe he'll stand down. Hurry, Kiros. We need to get back to Hermes, or Persephone might suspect something. I hear Persephone likes to test her new recruits, and I've got a bit of a temper. If you see me turning red... I'll think of something. Alrighty. Uh, considering how those literally just presented their mind control humans, I... Uh, I'm not too sure about this, you know? Something just fills up here. Where have you been? No one keeps Persephone waiting. It got complicated. We took a less direct route. What matters, Hermes, is I'm freed thanks to you. When I go to my queen, I will make sure she's grateful to you for my service. Explain it to Persephone. She's waiting. I'll make sure she knows this was entirely my fault, not yours. I'm sorry I was ungrateful. Kiros will make a strong guard. Thank you again, friend. Here, Hermes. Keeper! I've been robbed. These are dark times for Elysium. Those delinquent fools have robbed even me. What did they take? I fashioned a key. A recipe, if you will, for an eternal flame. I intended to gift it to Persephone. With it, she could shine her light, 
even in the underworld. An eternal flame could bring order to this chaos. You understand her burden better than you let on. By enduring her sacrifice, Persephone keeps us safe in the underworld. So write the recipe again. What I wrote took lifetimes. We can't let it stay in the hands of humans who would use it against her. Keep her. Uh, Cassandra, we have to steal it back. You're a good man for wanting to protect Persephone. I'll help. Ah, I thank you. You are quickly becoming my friend and ally. An eternal flame sounds more like a myth than some simple recipe. Pa, I began writing the recipe with your father. It's as real as the danger we'd face without it. Why do you go to these lengths to save Persephone? She wouldn't do the same for you. Since these humans started acting against her, she's been suffering. When she suffers, we all suffer. Hermes, has it occurred to you she might just be using you? Of course not. She simply needs someone to rely on. She needs me. I'll find the rebels and get your recipe. That's all I ask. If you are spotted or cause a commotion, we risk retaliation. Go unseen. All right. Mausoleum that one. All right, let's see where this goes. <laughs> we'll do all the ones we can, trying to be as like tactical as we can. Only kill when it's needed. So it's unavoidable. Said go quietly, so... Far. I don't want to be spotted here. But yeah, Hermes isn't that bright, it seems. Hermes asked me to go unseen. What's trying to do. Call us for prisoners. I have it. Where's the rest of it? Okay, at least it was the end, but I'm scared. I'm sure my brother were here. He'd know what to do. Oh. Okay, then. <sighs> Away over here. Huh? Oh. 
crap. Well, this isn't good. I mean bothering sneaking anymore we've been caught I was hoping to be able to do like a uh, critical assassination there but nope did not work out Just do what damage I could because I was like, that's not going to fill in in time. Go around, try to be as quiet as I can. Maybe just that one won't count. Doubt it, but maybe. There's a lot of them here. Isn't there, right? Yeah, right there. There we go. Have a film though, this isn't gonna go, they're not gonna be too happy with us. We need to get the recipe back. About that, here it is. You've spared this realm great suffering, my friend. I wonder, were you spotted? Of course not. But ah, Hermes... good. We don't risk retaliation. I'm giving these torn pieces back, Hermes. But I'm trusting you. A flame that never dies could consume all of Elysium. I swear to you as your friend, I will only use the flame if it's absolutely necessary. Hermes, things are worse in Elysium than I've been letting on. The rebels are organized and ready to fight. War is coming. We must crush the force behind the chaos. Let's fight for Persephone. You're so worried about Persephone, you can't even see. You're in just as much danger. You kept the eternal flame out of the hands of the humans, and you went unseen. We have the upper hand. We just have to strike. Calm yourself, Hermes. It's not like you're going to go on a rampage. And why not? There are so-called captains guiding the human forces. They invited chaos into this realm, so let's show them chaos. At least when you asked me to steal, it was from thieves. 
You're not a murderer, Hermes. You made me look like a fool when I sent you to Kiros. But I can still come back from that and prove my worth. I told you we were diverted. It doesn't matter. Please, I'm begging you, my friend. Help me to help her. <coughs> you think that your obsession with Persephone entitles you to her love? It doesn't. She will never love you, Hermes. And no amount of killing will change that. Enough! <coughs> All right, well, I guess we're fighting everybody in the next one. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you then.